Hello Pisces, welcome to your love reading for singles. Okay, I've been shuffling, thinking about you and your energy. And now I'm going to show you a new offer that I've got. I'm going to be doing a giveaway for a subscriber around the end of the month. My Myths and Mermaids Oracle. I've done a few readings in the past, Twin Flame Soulmate readings and... Um, other readings, pick a card readings, the Oracle of the Water. So they've got a couple of spreads here, and with every card reaching for the sunset, very poetic. They've actually got a little poem at the start and a description um, with uh, upright and reversed meanings show you a couple of the cards they come in um, upright format and postcard as well beautiful pictures beautiful meanings very expressive easy to shuffle very um well, I have never seen this one in all the years I've done it. This is the first time she's made a show. I wish I'd seen her before. Storm Chaser. I'm surprised. I love storms. Why didn't she come out? She's like, no, don't let me go. <laughs> Maybe. Um, but <laughs> that's my mermaid oracle of the water. It's beautiful. I'm giving it away to one lucky subscriber. So if you're interested, subscribe and I'll let you know if you're the winner before the end of the month. Alright, so let's target some questions in this reading, love for singles. Alright, this is about your past love situation. Present, okay, so someone's healing from Nine of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Temperance is, I think, Sagittarius. Um, and this is healing. Um, from somebody who is very independent, um, focused on their money, their business, their, you know, their life, being independent. Alright, healing. Someone is healing. One of you who are independent, working for yourself and for your life, uh, are healing. Okay, Ace of Pentacles, money coming in, big money. Alright, that's a, a nice pocket full of cash. Okay, so let's focus on actions to find love. Results, if you follow Spirit's guidance. Is love around you now? Six of Pentacles, giving to two Ace of Cups. Perfect new love. Herald of Swords, someone coming in telling you about um, that, they, that they love you. Beautiful. Um, is love around you now? What is delaying your love story? And final outcome. I'll clarify as well to give you a bigger picture of what I'm talking about. So this is for Pisces. I just want to focus on your energy again. Pisces, Pisces, Pisces. Love for singles, Pisces. Okay, thank okay. you. Alright, awesome. Pisces. Past love situation. The Hermit. Oh, this is... Um, Solitude, spending time alone, contemplating, thinking, going within. Why do I get a little bit of depression, anxiety as well? Just feeling like you need to focus within and really think about where you're going to go next and what you're going to do. All right, very deep card. I just feel it. Present situation, two of wands. A decision needs to be made. Okay, am I going to go forward in my life or am I going to stay back there? But if you go forward, there is so much more for you. In the But it's like, see how she's looking in the back? Am I going to keep going? Am I going to hold on to that or am I going to let it go? The past and the future. Okay, actions to find love. Ten of Wands, a very big burden. To go towards love is a very big burden. Could 
could be very hurtful very big heavy burden i'll clarify and give you more don't worry okay <coughs> results if you follow uh spirit's guidance oh the sun that's the happiest card in the deck complete illumination of the truth the sun is um you know that happiness when you see a little kid running towards the swings and they're laughing and they're feeling really good about themselves. I'm going to have the best time ever on the swings, you know, because it's an innocent, sweet, happy fun. Okay, that's the sun. That's why in a lot of the card decks, uh, the sun is represented by a little child that's laughing and happy running through um, daffodils or whatever it is. And they're just happy. Sunflowers everywhere happiest card in the deck that's if you follow spirits advice but you've got to go through the through the or some kind of really heavy burden it's a completion of a burden so spirit is also telling me you need to let go and i feel that's why you were in hermit mode because you didn't know how to let this go you know two of wands do i let it go or do i hold on spirits saying let it go all right, um, is love around you now? Seven of Wands. Love is on guard right now. The walls are up and they're saying, don't come close. I'll clarify and I can tell you why. <laughs> Just bear with me. All right, what's delaying love? What is the delay? The hanged man. Someone is saying, staying stagnant and on pause. Probably you being the hermit. Indecisive with future and uh, history in the past carrying a heavy burden and not letting it go but as soon as you you chuck this out these old skeletons that don't belong in your closet anymore it's the sun it's like oh thank god it's gone and then you know your love is on guard because someone is stagnant and still and on pause not moving forward and not moving back just staying stuck until they crust away and the crows are there. Okay, outcome. Knight of Pentacles coming in slowly, but this knight gathers stuff along the way. He makes sure every rock is, you know, checked. <laughs> you know, doesn't leave anything unturned. Make sure every branch of the tree in the forest that he walks through is spot on. You know, he makes sure every certificate is done, every diploma kind of. This guy, he collects everything along the way. And when he gets to the finish line, 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 <laughs> line he's there to stay. Okay, he's not moving anywhere. He's not bringing his keys. He's actually bringing everything. Okay. All right, let's clarify with my gorgeous can't remember what they're called <laughs> the good tarot that's right the good tarot and uh this this cards that i used here are the archaean tarot nine of fire mm, nine of wands six of fire a lot of fire um so are you with the fire sign aries leo sagittarius nine of fire is someone on guard six of fire is someone coming in like a rock star a celebrity someone feeling like the top star feeling really good about what they've done because they've gone through a rough trot probably you because this looks like a really difficult moment in time oh my goodness oh transformation yeah death change you need change in between the hermit and two of wands getting out of that hermit mode of contemplation and really thinking hard about that two of wands uh, which is inevitable having to make that decision forward or back okay the hermit why nine of air nine of air is pain going within focused on the pain my throat chakra is tightening up from this it's just pain agony it's really really bad ten of uh, swords is like going within thinking oh my god what am i going to do how am i going to get over this you get over that by making that decision to go forward strength thank you spirit this is perfect 
this is exactly what Pisces needs strength to go forward yes see the lion is propelling her forward like it's almost like she's looking back at the lion and the lion's like go on keep going can you see that she's like looking at the lion and the lion's like roaring quietly keep going go forward can you see that isn't spirit perfect perfect messages for my Pisces ten of wands temptation that's a devil energy actions to find love let go and uh, that's devil energy won't let you let go it's a devil energy not letting you let go of that burden you won't let go it's a devil energy the sun results in uh, results if you follow spirits guidance by letting go the sun nine of water nine of water is a wish come true look at that beautiful mermaid she's been swimming in the ocean alone and suddenly she gets the jackpot a diamond in the rough it's a diamond wish come true oh my god i found a diamond i'm gonna give this to king triton <laughs> or something happiest card in the deck she won she got the diamond just magically it's there she's like look at it oh my god that's if you follow spirit's advice and let go of this burden I couldn't make this up if I tried. Is love around you now? Ooh, seven of oh, your love has a, a decision to make. They're on guard, and they need to make a choice, an analytical decision. Okay, two of swords, two of air. She's literally oh, that's so beautiful. She's got two birds, one in one hand. And they're both so delicate. Which one does she let go? They're both so perfect. A very hard decision. What does she do? This one or that one? Which one? Oh, that's so sad. She has to let go of one. She's on guard because she's going through that process. Your person, him or she. Him or shim. <laughs> All right. Uh, Ace of Pentacles. Beautiful. I love it. The hangman. Ace of Pentacles is a windfall or a financial windfall or instability. Money coming in. Or um, what is the delay in this love situation? Money coming in, prosperity, abundance, or stability, growth, instability. This is brand new because it's an ace, a new journey. Okay, stagnant and still not coming in. Not, you know, this ace of pentacles is there, mature, ready, ready to, to fly, ready to go with abundance. Okay, he's ready. Ace of pentacles is ready. Ace of pentacles is the money. Big bag of money, uh, inheritance, um, a windfall, winning something or could be you know a new house a new car something good something positive stable secure for the long haul moving in together or something something great and grand okay being stagnant and stuck and still see that hangman he's been there for a long time so sacrificing himself in time staying still and this deer is waiting to go and the hangman won't let him okay knight of pentacles outcome why five of water yeah five of pentacles he like i said he's coming he's bringing everything but he's the slowest guy in the race he's slow he's gonna take a long time this is years the swords is like weeks you know the ones is months and no other way around swords is days Wands is uh, weeks, cups is months, and this guy is years. All right, so it's like this five of water. Is this you getting sick of it, saying, I regret this ever started? This is regret, remorse, grief, mourning, sorrow, and loss. Five of cups, she's 
grieving. Even a little seahorse beside her is sad. It's like I'm so sorry. Nine of uh, Pentacles. Too slow. I'll get another energy oracle. Oh, I'll get a energy oracle. I haven't gotten one yet. Just to give me some more insight. Oh, damn. All right. So, all right. That's not how it showed. It presented like, I don't know. Anyway, Goddess of the Moon is the um, secrets needing to go within psychic development spirituality being one with all that is okay this is walking away uh, from hostilities okay needing to focus on spiritual growth okay and here we have rest and rejuvenation of the thinking man this is going back in hermit mode rest getting some r and r to think all right let me know how this resonates pisces i send you much love and healing okay all right i look forward to your next reading bye for now